Turning now to the coronavirus, today Ohio Governor Mike DeWine announcing that his administration is now working to address the racial disparity in the vaccine rollout. The health department's latest numbers show that of the more than 880,000 Ohioans who've been vaccinated, just 42,000 are black. WCPO 9 News reporter Kristen Swilly found out what's being done locally to level the playing field. Center for Closing the Health Gap works with more than 60 local organizations to spread the word about COVID-19. They've been doing that since the onset of the pandemic. Now that same network is trying to make sure everyone who wants the vaccine can get one. It's going to take time. Um, but we don't have a lot of time. It's a resource as precious as the vaccine itself. Renee Mahaffey Harris is the president and CEO of the Center for Closing the Health Gap, which works to move the needle on disparities. She says faith in the science and the system remains an issue. Mistrust is not fixed by simply saying we have a strategy. Um, mistrust means that, you know, the people who who you get your information from for anything who you trust the most are people that are closest to you. The Health Collaborative, which partners with local vaccine providers, is working to change things too. Equity is so important. Our goal here is to save lives. She says the team is connected to clergy, educators, and activists, the voices that could carry the most weight for some in this vaccine rollout. The partnerships are critical because of the trust, because we listen to people that we trust. We listen to people that we know. For those willing to get a shot, Mahaffey Harris says the next critical point is access. Access, but if that's not attainable because of internet access or transportation, the effort is for naught. You start questioning whether or not is the system really set up to work for me. Work continues to make sure that answer is yes. The state's equity strategy includes more vaccine sites, including those in affordable housing, transportation, and media geared toward the black community. So we, we have a ways to go, but I know that we are moving in the right direction. Kristen Swilly, WCPO, 9 News.